I mean, take the great Northern Pacific trash gyre, which everyone gets, you know, you bring it up, everyone's like, oh, you know, animals are dying, it's all bad, but, you know, the Raymond point of view is like, wow, isn't it great that there's a whole other continent on Earth now that we can talk about that exists that wasn't there before. So, so Ray, Raymond's able to find the joy in the worst situation as well. And, and then there's this sidekick, Neil, who he just sort of fails forward no matter what. The two of them are a wonderful pair together. I am a big reality fan. I don't watch Big Brother, which is big in England, but um, I am, I wouldn't say proud, but I have seen every single episode of Survivor USA ever filmed. I love it. They're on season 27 right now, and I couldn't miss it. Um, you know, if you try and glamorize it, or if you try and make it respectable, it really is a, a terrific way of learning about human politics very quickly, and how even the slightest slip up here can have this like catastrophic domino effect way down there. So I, I, love, I love that show. Do I watch anything else? It's my one reality show. And in a weird, backward way, yes, this book is a love letter to Survivor. I can barely hold it together in regular daily life, let alone like, oh, I'm surrounded by twits. I mean, it, I don't, you know, you have to keep a poker face. And that's the one thing I don't have is a poker face. You know, whatever I feel, it's like, bleh, it's on, it's showing. Ever since my hair turned white, suddenly I'm a curmudgeon. Yeah. Before that, I was a social social chronicler. Now I'm just curmudgeon. Uh, it allows you to be a bit more not honest. You can just be a bit more yourself. Um, uh, but I think that's what happens with age anyways. You know, this just, I, it, it's, it runs in the family, so I kind of been waiting for it actually. I was born to be this age. I mean, I've always been pretty free in my head, but uh, been much freer lately, and, you know. Everyone's sort of got their own life going on inside their head. You know, they're not really thinking about you or me or anything. They're thinking about like me themselves. And why did it take me all this time to figure that out? You know, so no, better late than ever.